There's so much to know, so many people to meet, so much adventure awaits. What are you waiting for? Hey y'all, I'm Jamie Doris, Miss Congeniality. Join me each week as we make connections, face fears, and share love, all while being totally fabulous. There's no topic off limits, no story too bold. Together, we'll try it all. Prepare to be surprised with me, Jamie Doris. I am Miss Congeniality. Hello and welcome to Miss Congeniality. I'm your host, Jamie Doris, and today, guess what we're doing, you guys? We are doing something that I've wanted to do my entire life. We are in Siberia, Russia, about to have the adventure of a lifetime. A friend of mine, Anna, invited me out here to the camp and um, what's the name of this city? Woodnikova. And we're about to be doing some snowmobiling. <laughs> uh, we're gonna be doing a Russian bunya. And then I jump in the snow. We're gonna be having some food with her entire family. And of course, you're gonna meet her yourself. Because I'm a Siberian woman. It's, for me, it's not so cold. This is the adventure of a lifetime, and I'm so glad to share it with all of you. I hope you enjoy it as much as I enjoy doing it for you. Drink it. It's not champagne. Oh my God. <laughs> really? Yes. This is what happens when you go to Russia. But first, a word from our sponsors. All right, you guys, welcome back. Guess who is with us today? This is Anna Artemanova. She is somebody that I have been cyber stalking for about two years over on Instagram. I met her daughter, Sophia. I think you met her in the last episode. I met her daughter when she was an exchange student, right? Yes. In my city in America, and now we have reversed the roles. I'm back here with you, and I want you to meet Anna, Anna, thank you for having me here at your camp. Yeah, welcome to Siberia. Yay! <laughs> so I have been cyber stalking you for like two years. Are you aware of that? Did you know that I've been cyber stalking your Instagram? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. you did? Yes, I did, <laughs> yes. And I'm really waiting for you. Really? Yes. I, you know, since, we've, since I've been here, we've only talked for just maybe a couple of hours and I feel so close to you. Me too. I feel like we're like really good friends already. Yes, me too. So what have you learned from me so far with just being around me? Oh, it's maybe a difficult question for me, uh, but I really feel that I knew you before. I have knew you before, really. I don't understand why. Really? Yes, and you know that you are first uh, a woman in my life uh, from America. I'm an American woman. I'm the first yes, American yes, in your life. Yes, yes. I'm the first really American in yes, your life. Yes, because you know that I have never been in America. And uh, so you're my first woman. Wow! <laughs> from America, yes. Well, I'm hoping I represent America well. Yes, wow. yes. So tell me about this family property. Tell or tell the audience. Tell us about this area that we're at. Yes, it's my favorite place in this world because um, you know if you if you can understand so silence here and uh, we are really uh, all my family we are really enjoy this banya uh -huh. banya it's so special and and now we will try our snowmobile yes we're yes. going to be doing the snowmobiles in just a second so this is your family's property yes how often do you come out here i think twice a month per month twice per month it is so peaceful out here y'all yes. you just have no idea how peaceful it is yes. and the snow i've never seen this much snow yes how are you not cold no i'm i'm okay because i'm siberian woman it's <laughs> for me it's not so cold because you know now only minus seven Ooh. but generally in this time minus 25. okay 
So you are lucky, <laughs> because <laughs> because when when we have so so cold weather, it's very very, it's not so comfortable because it's so cold. Yes. Yes. So you're saying this is comfortable. This is comfortable. Okay, I brought the heat from Mississippi. Is yes. that what I did? Yes. Awesome. Okay, so like Anna just said, we're going to be starting snowmobiles first with our grand adventure in Siberia. So after the break, we're going to be doing that. Do not miss this, y'all. You're going to stay with us. So let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Alex, um, what is the stereotype of girls in America? Oh, uh, in the Russia, very most big stereotype on the girls is sorry for my english sorry uh many girls of america is evil evil uh, evil yeah evil evil yes uh, where are you Ang angry uh, angry oh they could be hangry maybe yes. that's it hungry and angry hungry <laughs> angry angry <laughs> angry bird but my excuse me <laughs> stay tuned for more miss congeniality Let's talk about something that women don't want to talk about, and that is incontinence. We at the Women's Clinic have a simple procedure that we can do to take care of that. We use the Fatona laser. Um, it's a simple procedure. You have tightening. You have enhanced lubrication. Um, sex isn't painful anymore, and you don't have that leakage that you deal with on a daily basis. Come see us at the Women's Clinic in Gulfport. We're right by Gulfport Memorial Hospital. <laughs> All right, y'all, we're back, and I had to get changed because they said the dress was not going to work for snowmobiling. And you guys, this is Alexander here. This is Anna's father, and he is going, he's telling me I need to wear these. I need yes. to put these on? Yes. Yes? I need to. Okay. You know, this has been a struggle for me because I don't speak Russian, mm -hmm. obviously, and a lot of Russians don't speak English, and so <laughs> we're having to just kind of, you know, <laughs> sign language. Uh -huh. But I like you and you like me, so we're good. Yeah. Am I ready, Alexander? Yes. I'm calling him Alexander the Great. <laughs> All right, let's do this. I've never snowmobiled in my whole life. <laughs> this is like my mom here. When I was an exchange student back in the day, I didn't speak any Portuguese. I was an exchange student in Brazil. And so my Brazilian mother had to only speak Portuguese to me and it was great. Well today, Galina, this is Anna's mother, she's been doing nothing but speaking Russian. And it's been great. I've been learning all sorts of words. Yeah. Mushka, mum. Mushka? Uh-huh. Mam Mamachka. Mamachka. That means to that means eat. First thing she's asked me. Mamachka? Da. Yes. Da. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, of course. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Okay, hi. Hi, am I? The snowmobiling was so fun. It was like white. That's all it was. It was just white. And we were just going in there. Uh, and of course, I was trying to turn it, go this way and go that way. And Alexander was like, no, straight. Loshit. Loshit. Chorne. Красиве. Yes, so yes. the beautiful black horse. Black horse, beautiful. So beautiful, yes, yes. So, you guys, we were supposed to be snowmobiling, which we did do, and then Alexander gave me a surprise visit to what I'm assuming is this, um, like, a farm, because he's got cows, oh, oh, and he's got horses. This is Lugu. And it's so beautiful out here. It's just like so amazing. I think that the horses are used for, for um, work and then the cows are used for both meat and for cheese. Alexander! And sleep? Oh, it stays. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> yes. Milk. Milk, yeah. yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> Where to next, Alexander? Yeah. 
сяду. Сяду. На лошадь. На лошадь. Okay, we weren't we weren't planning this. Yes. Oh, all right, that made me feel really old right there. I had to have my whole body lifted up. Here? Interesting, learning how to ride a horse in Russian. <laughs> Good posture. Ya Jenchina. I am woman. Ya Jenchina. Koza, 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 koza. These are goats. Goats. Koza, koz milk. Cheese. Cheese. Uh, goat. I love goat cheese. Do you like goat cheese? I love goat cheese. Oh, look at them. They have no idea that they are Russian goats. Oh, God. This just gets better and better. I got a baby goat. Koza. Baby? Baby? Koza. <laughs> baby, Koza. No, baby goat. <laughs> Look how cute. <laughs> I don't know that I've ever held a goat before. Look at this. It's a baby goat. It's a baby goat. It's a baby casa. <laughs> oh. Hello. Oh. Two, two, yes. two. Oh. 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 Come on. <laughs> Billy, Billy, Billy. Billy, Billy. White one. White one. <laughs> this is so dang fun. All right, I don't know what's happening next. I mean, I thought I did, but I don't know. <laughs> Do you think I'm evil? No, no, no. You're very beautiful. Very, no, pee pee pee. Wee -wee -wee -wee. <laughs> Serious. I want to I wanna look uh, in... Uh, I want to look in your eye and uh, write, uh, give me emotion. Yes, I write in your eye, give me emotion, please. I want emotion, <laughs> emotion for the people most, most people. In the, yeah. That's what you see in my eye? Yes. That I want emotion or you want emotion? You want emotion and uh, most people. Oh, give me emotion, please. <laughs> I, Jamie, I give emotion. <laughs> Look like a million bucks without spending it. Here at Back on the Rack, we sell only the brands that you trust. Jade, Carly, Chanel, Dolce & Gabbana, Tibby, Kate Spade, Louis Vuitton, and more. Back on the Rack, upscale resale. We buy and sell across the U.S. and you can shop right on Facebook. It's luxury consignment for the stylish woman. This tour just keeps on going, you guys. Alexander, I told Alexander that I was hungry. I said, I need to get something to eat. And he said, okay, go eat. It's his cheese factory. Oh. Okay. Yes, you can speak. Sophia. Sophia. Hi, how are you? How was your flight? Hey, my, the flight was smooth. It was awesome. Oh my God. So, you know, you and I did a show in Moscow and it was right. totally incredible. And you told me that I was not understanding what was going to be meeting me in Siberia. And I was not. Your family is incredible. <laughs> your mother, your grandfather, your grandmother, they are so amazing. I just got the farm tour. The snowmobile tour. Oh, really? Yes. You already done it? Yes. Oh my God. That's yes. <laughs> yes. And then I told your grandfather that I was hungry, and then he goes, "Okay, go eat." Yeah. And then he pulled up at the cheese factory. Yes. And now we will try our cheese, our delicious cheese. Oh, I can't wait. Oh I love God. cheese. <laughs> oh my God! I'm so happy. So, do you guys get along? Do you understand each other? Yes. Actually, I understand your mother perfectly. We have connected so well, Good and God. I feel like we're like soul sisters. Like my soul really? is connected. Yes, and then your grandfather, yeah. well, we don't really understand each other, but we've been teaching each other words. So like he taught me Billy and Loisius and Kaza and some other, oh, Milo, 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 no. 
No, Malako. Me. Malako. Malako. Yes. Malako. So he's been teaching oh me words. God. Very good. Translate. <laughs> yes. I was telling you about Oh, this is awesome. I mean, it is, and like, you know, the audience is getting a view of Russia that nobody else gets. They're getting a family. Yes, we're filming, right? yes, we're filming so, as we speak. So, oh, wow. very good speak, yes. <laughs> 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 but yeah, this is like a cool tour. It's like the same family on one side of Russia and then the next. Yeah, right. Oh, Thank you God. so much. So Spasiba. <laughs> we already got the snowmobile. We got the tour of the farm. And now we are eating the fruits of the labor of the farm. And Anna's joining us. And Galina's here. And take it away. Tell us all about the cheese we're about to be eating. Yes. I want to let you try this one because it's the most fresh. This fresh cheese right here. Yes, Do you want me to yes. try it right now? Yeah. Okay. I'll try it. It's a uh, like very milk, like yeah. It is. It's like milk. Yeah. I'm yeah. Gonna some more. It's I like that. Like yes. And, and when do I need to drink the wine? Because yes. clearly I need to drink the wine constantly. Yes. And uh, the, this cheese will be good with uh, sparkling wine too, mm. like prosecco or maybe champagne. And. Mm. After that, this cheese, three month, three month. Okay. Was that you? After. That's you. Alexander. No. That's you. Yeah. Is this a beer that you yeah, brew? Beer. Oh my god. This guy, like, he does everything. I swear. Now his face is on a beer too. Wow. Well, pop it open. I just cannot imagine how I got so lucky as to enjoy this type of experience. Like, they never even meet Americans out here. They never meet Americans. So I'm pinching myself <laughs> through the outfit. <laughs> and then, we are getting to experience this together. So, all right, you guys, on the other side of the break, I think we're gonna be taking our snowmobiles back to the camp and then trying the Russian banya. So stay with us. What is one thing that you think I need to do while I'm here in Russia? Um, to taste vodka. <laughs> okay. And where shall I do this? Okay, I don't know because I really, uh, as for me, I tasted the vodka one, one my time. <laughs> yes, and I don't like it, but there's no taste, but there are a lot of alcohol in <laughs> So. Vodka is a very good uh, drink because uh, it's not like whiskey or bourbon or kinds of that. Uh, many Russians think that uh, colored alcohol is uh, bad, is uh, worse uh, for your health. And vodka is uh, clear like, uh, <laughs> like, like brilliance. Remember I told you that uh, Russian, when we are drinking, we do that, not this jest. Like we show it like like that. Why? Well, I think it's like warm in here when you're drinking strong stuff, so it's like, you know. You're getting it in the system yep. or something? Yeah, 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 like, put it in, <laughs> I don't know. And you guys showing like that, Yeah. makes sense though. So, yeah, like you're yeah. turning it up. Because yeah. mm. we call it turn it up. <laughs> and you're like, get it in the vein. Yep, yep, <laughs> just like that. <laughs> Stay tuned for more Miss Congeniality. Oh my God, you guys. Okay, this is the moment I know you've been waiting for. I've definitely been waiting for. This is the Russian <laughs> sauna. They call it a banya. We're gonna go in the sauna for about 15 minutes with Anna oh, no. and her I dad, um, Alexander, that you've met. And then we're gonna come out and roll in the snow. Oh my God, let's do this. <laughs> let's do it. Oh. Oh, <laughs> 
Я снимаю уже. А, Хихи Звейди. Я даже не это. Пап, сильно не надо нам сейчас. So something I adore about you is that you are so beautiful on Instagram. <laughs> I'm like so super duper jealous of you, Anna. I want to know what are your beauty secrets? You are gorgeous, you guys. I know she wouldn't mind me telling you this. She's 41. Секунду. She. Секунду, секунду, сейчас. Yes. But, oh but but it was my secret about my age. No. Yeah. <laughs> is it a secret or not? You want to say it or not? No, I can't say about this. It's okay. But I think it's genetic, first of all, genetic, because you you looked at my parents and so on. But another one, of course, healthy food. But I think the most important things for me uh, is because I was born in Siberia. Really? Because, yes. You know that I I like. Uh, like kept or keep uh, in the fridge. Oh, you're kept in the yeah, fridge. fridge. That's oh, that's your beauty <laughs> secret. You are yeah. frozen in time. Yes. Oh, she's like Elsa, but from Siberia. Have you heard of Elsa? You know, Disney princess? No. No. Okay, that's okay. She's like Elsa, but from Siberia. So anything else? What else do you do to stay so beautiful other than being in a fridge? What do you do? Like, what are your beauty like appointments? I think only this. Genetic, good food, gym, yoga, and was born in Siberia. That's all. And the sauna. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the sauna. Wow. Oh my god, you guys. Alexander is doing the next part of the banya treatment. It's the beating. Oh my god. Okay. And then I jump in the snow. Oh, really? Really? Uh, oh! Oh my god! 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 Oh my Let's do it again! Oh! <laughs> really? No! No! More! No! <laughs> More ice! Really? Wow, you guys. That was an experience. Um, I have to say that I feel not only relaxed from that, but I feel a release. And while I was sitting in the sauna, Anna told me her favorite thing when she's in the sauna is to open the window and listen to the Siberian silence. And it's like so peaceful. So on that note, I'm gonna get changed, catch you on the other side of the break and we're gonna have dinner and say goodbye. Ooh. Tell me, um, have you ever done a banya? Oh, yeah. A banya? Uh -huh. Russian banya? I like Russian banya, yes, of course. Banya, it's very, very good. Talk, talk, Venix, nice. Birioza, birioza. See you soon, birioza. Is that the thing you beat yourself with? Yes. Pak, pak, podmishki, tak, tak, za kabanyo. Lico da podmishki. Don't stinky. Because of all the banya. Don't stinky because, because very jara. Солнце, сан, огонь, fire, камни там, короче, very good. It's your day here at Michael Vincent Salon. Whether you come in for a cut and color or a manicure and massage, we want you to feel relaxed. We are trendy, light, friendly, and downtown. Our clients become our friends. Come as you are, leave as a star. Michael Vincent Salon, Highway 49 downtown Gulfport. Oh, that looks good. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow.
Okay, y'all. Well, welcome back. This is our Russian feast with our family over here, the Otwinova family. We've got Anna, and we've got Galina, and we've got Alexander, and they are feeding me a lovely feast after today's festivities. So what do we got going on, Anna? Now we uh, need to try the soup. Ooh. It's shurpa. Shurpa. Pa, yes, with lamb. Lamb. Lem. Okay. Yes. And potato. Yes, so delicious. Just try it. Okay, and this is a Russian soup, I'm assuming. <coughs> yeah, <coughs> Russian soup. Okay. Aha! Uh -huh. yeah, so, so good going down because it's hot uh -huh. and it's cold outside. Yeah. What you got going on over there? Yes, and uh, what do you want to drink? Vodka, maybe. Vodka? Do you want to try? I need vodka. I haven't had vodka at all since I've been here. Yeah. And I've been here for like five days. I haven't had any vodka. Yes. Now my dad uh, will find something for you. Okay. Yay. <laughs> Russian vodka. Russian vodka. Now do I sip or do I... Uh, Anna спрашивает, uh, my dad will show you. Oh, he's going to show me how to drink vodka. this. Так? I'm gonna be drunk. Yeah. No. Я могу быть пьяный. Just try. Okay. Just try a little bit. Самые хорошие девушки у нас пьяные. No, 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 no. To, it's, it's impossible. Oh, you gotta just drink it's, it. It's not champagne. Oh my God. <laughs> Yes. This is what happens when you go to Russia. Yeah. <laughs> oh. 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 oh my eat god. Meat. Yeah, eat yeah, meat. Yeah, okay, okay. 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 Cucumber. okay, Cuba. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Alright guys. That's all the time we have left for today. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Miss Congeniality. I know they certainly did. I did too, just kidding. Remember. <laughs> Love yourself, be yourself, and let's make this world a more beautiful place and drink vodka. Until next time, I am Miss Congeniality. We, we drank vodka so seldom. Oh, not not no, so often. No, 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 um, maximum two or three, maximum. No, yes, правило. But but we have a rule. Re regulament. Three. Three of these. Only three. <laughs> Yes, I'm not that. drinking three! <laughs> no! That was plenty! Alexander, no! <laughs>